So this is the ultra sleeper Burford duo. really bright in here, I think we've got all the lights on. It's on a Mercedes. This one's got the travel seats. Oh, it's it? got some travel seats. What do they like to sit on there? Really we nice. discovered that the table moves table, forward. The table does move, so you can get, you can yeah, get so your feet in there. Yeah, similar to what we've got there, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Probably at the front here. It is really nice. Yeah. Good size kitchens, drawers, cutlery drawer, full cooker, single beds, very similar layout to our van again. We always end up looking at the same layout, don't we? <laughs> Wonder why. Yeah, and it, it's a bigger wardrobe than we've got. It comes out a bit further. Obviously you've got one on the other side. Two plug holes, yeah, either end. Yeah, either end, so if you're not quite on a level. Little sink bowl. We've all got these little sink bowls now, so yeah, I don't think... Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. bigger than the eldest Yeah, though. yeah, it's a slightly bigger one. Yeah. And um, your TV would go over there, wouldn't it? On yeah, this, so it's very side. similar to what yeah. we've got, isn't it? Right, so this is a Roller Team T Line 785. And there's a different type lounge, isn't it? What's like two two sort of seats there, aren't they? Yeah. Separate seats. It's a drop down bed above. Above, yeah. Yeah. Good square sink, a little bit of workspace, three burner hob, combi oven. I've got to put these pull out trays. No. Wow, those beds yes. are length, aren't they? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Mm, must be about seven foot. You won't have any problem with that. I, was going to, I thought there was a step there, no step there. Lovely shower. Loads of light in here, isn't there? Mm -hmm. This uh, fridge with a drawer at the bottom. Truma. TV's up there. This is a Roller Team, oh, Roller Team Auto Roller 707. The first thing you know. Yeah, it's certainly a different layout. And it's a bunk bed, double bunk bed, goes all the way back over there. Oh yeah, that's a quite a deep bunk bed as well, quite wide. And a drop down bed as well. Oh, there's a lot to take in here isn't there, so combi oven, three burner hob, sink, I guess the bathroom's here. Right, okay, a bit of duck board on the I'm using. It's a, like a doubles up as a shower. I don't think I'd be happy using a shower with all that wood in there, is it? It's got a curtain or something. I'm going to take that back so I can't find out. But yeah, hmm. This was not. It's not real wood, is it? So, this is for six people, so you can yeah. see compromise, haven't you? Yeah. These are gaining popularity. Oh, I couldn't see the handle. Because the, ha the handle's in black. Mm. <laughs> can't see it. Yep. 
all the extra cushions in there, which will go straight in the garage. Well, no, not people on the Well, you've got a drop. Oh, it's six, it's six, six people. people. Yeah, wow. Yeah. So, of course it is. Yeah, so I, th I can see why they've done it. Can you? Yeah, well, if you sit in the cor sit in the corner, you can put your feet up, can't you? Yeah, true. You turn around. Yeah. Are oh, you not warm in all that coat? No. <laughs> so you've got like two L-shaped sofas, haven't you? So you've got this one. Let's see this. You've got this one here. There's an L-shaped sofa, and you've got another L-shaped sofa here. We've got two travel seats So you've got here. Two tra one travel seat there yeah. and another set of travel seats there. So you obviously move this. So you remove that cushion. And then put that in with the other cushions yeah. when you're yeah. moving. And you'd move that one. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, it's an ingenious design. And then you've got, you can't see it from there, can you? So then you've got your drop down bed there. You, you've got a bed underneath there. And bunk beds at the back. Yeah, you could do six beds people in seats, here. Isn't Sorry? Beds and seats. Beds and seats. Well, I think with six people, that's probably what you need, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You want to have enough beds and seats for six people. I think I prefer the, the dinette opposite each other, though. Yeah. But I mind you, this. Well, it doesn't mean you. Out well, yeah, because a, a huge table that you all. Sit round. So yeah. That's yeah. Quite nice. Yeah. Well, it was a good layout for six. Obviously thought about this, haven't they? Mm. You've got the kitchen is well, it's out of the way enough, isn't it? I suppose the at the back I noticed, so you could probably put the bunk beds up, so you've got more of it. Make that into a garage, then, couldn't you? Because <laughs> right. we've got a big door on the side of it. The bunk beds in. Yeah. You've got a door there. Yeah, that's a lot of van for fifty thousand pounds. Yeah. yeah, that is where it cleverly makes up into yeah. a huge bed. Yeah. Yeah. Westphalia Kepler 6. Lovely leather seats. Those travel seats look really nice. So Come. Can make the bed up in that then? I assume that these, these forward. pull forward, yeah. don't they? Yeah, or well, you've got the bed, I think you've got a drop down bed in there. In, in the, the roof there, roof you're more right. likely to use that, aren't you? Yeah. Is that plant again? Yeah. <laughs> Provided with the show, no doubt. Yeah. Yellowstone. Yellowstone. Say how much? Oh, it does. Yeah, it does. Hey, Sixty-five thousand pounds. Two point three one thirty HP. Yeah. So it's got all the bits on it, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Let's have a look. Yeah, you did. Yeah. A lovely smell of leather in here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, that's the table. Fold up table. You could like, just use it two yeah. of you, couldn't you? And then yeah, you leave it like that, it's just two of you, and then yeah. you've got other people in there. They're good. Yeah, for a panel van, that's excellent. Lou, there's a shower unit, pull down basin, isn't it? I've seen that. Push. Oh, you. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> that drops down on your arm. <laughs> yeah. Huge bed. Makes into a double. This is the fridge. Oh, that's not bad, is it? That's not bad at all. Fridge you can put bottled yeah. water in. Yeah. 
proper water. And the sink. Yeah. Tap. Yeah, it's a pop up, pop up tap, so it just comes up. Alright. Absolutely massive bed. Yeah. You can figure out where the feet are. No, I mean that, that's an issue, isn't it? Because you've got yeah. coming down there. You have to be careful. You have you? to be really careful. You don't put your foot there instead of there. Instead of there, yeah. Yeah. Same sort of thing. Transverse bed again. I, I mean. Band this size, I wouldn't want to travel with, with, and sleep with four people here. I don't mean sleep with four people. <laughs> I mean have well, four people sleeping in you'd here. You'd lose two of them up there, wouldn't you? Well, you would. You wouldn't. They wouldn't be up there all the time, though, would they? <laughs> <laughs> all four of you be at the front here. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, it's a great idea having pop-up bed. But oh, I'm not sure. This is a Westphalia Columbus 641E. interesting isn't it look how sloped the seats are here yeah but they're really comfortable yeah yeah yeah, yeah. sort of hug you yeah <laughs> yeah. not sure if you'd be so keen on how high up these beds are well, not too bad no, they're at waist heights and there's a step here. So you can get you can easily get in. Mm. It's a very nice, um, bright interior. Yeah, yeah it is. Well, it's all white and cream, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So how long is that? That's long enough. Really, yeah. There's loads of cupboard space, isn't there? Yeah, they've done away with the idea of a wardrobe, I've just got to hang in there. So that might annoy your feet, though, mightn't it? Yeah, I suppose. Would <laughs> <laughs> your feet? Yeah. Well, Wouldn't yeah, annoy yeah. the rest of you then, just your feet? Well, your feet are up here, aren't they? Yeah. And there's some clothes, and yeah. they're sort of. Yeah, they'd be annoying. Like, yeah. Yeah, that's a nice touch, the hanging rail there. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's a really comfortable bed. Yeah, I'm just saying, uh, US, USB point, switches up there. Lots of workspace. Really comfortable seats. Yeah, again, I don't want to get out of these seats. Automatic. Automatic. Yeah. Storage space up there. Good table, not yeah, too not too bit. not too heavy with the swivelly bit. Yeah. So this is a Kimberley Vision 575, so coachman caravan. That's such a nice lounge. It is, isn't it? Cooker. Yeah. That tap. <laughs> that tap. <laughs> that tap. 
Okay, that's sage and thyme. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a tr transverse bed, isn't it? So it's one of these ones that pull out so you can walk around it. Yeah. Well, they've got loads of lights on well, there. <laughs> it's got a great big lights up there. So. Yeah. I mean, the fabrics. Yeah. Yeah. This has got some like a blue tape with it, isn't it? It's yeah. Like blue and grey. Yeah. Light voice. Hmm. So this is a Kimberley Vision 545 with an yeah. island, island bed at the back. At the back. So, same sort of layout. In here, bathroom sort of in the middle. Oh, I didn't expect that. So as you walk in, you've got the bathroom in front of you. Shower there. And the bed, and bedroom at the back. That's not a bad idea. You've got your own door, haven't you? It's yeah. Yeah. So you can close it off. <laughs> so you can close that door. You can close that door. Yeah, and you're sealed in. Yeah. Just shower, yeah. It's a nice shower. It's a slidey roundy thing. <laughs> Not wobbly things. <laughs> Cars, Jen, Jenny. But the only thing we haven't looked at now is cars. Yeah. Hiya. All right. Did you need some help or you were just having a look? I'm just looking. Yeah. Yeah. If you do need a brochure, send it out. Let me know. Thanks a lot. Nice, isn't it? Yeah. It's about the size of a Volvo, isn't it? It's a Subaru XV Premier Lineatronic. Ugh. Stylish. Mm -hmm. 
It's a stunning looking van, isn't it? 